Hey there, everyone. Welcome back to The Void. Happy Thanksgiving. I, it's uh, super rainy and wet here in LA where I am, so that's fun. Uh, but at least I have this yellow screen. I made a video a couple days ago on the main channel about 123Go, um, which is a channel entirely about our post-apocalyptic future. When we're making these videos, we kind of film for a long time and there's a lot of material that is eventually cut out in the editing process. And for this video, I had a cut of it that was like an hour long. And no one wants to hear two boys complain about the post-apocalypse for, for a whole hour at once. So I've broken it into two parts. And this is part two. Essentially, it's the same one, two, three, go clips from that first video, but um, with some new jokes and reactions and stuff that I cut out of the main video and some stuff that was in the original video just to like give context. I have no idea if anyone is interested in this, but um, I figured it would be just like a little alternate universe version of my last video. But before we get into the video, I have new merch and it's only gonna be around for like a week. So I'm telling you about it because I really want you to get it if you want it. It's really good. It's uh, with, I did it with Champion. There's like a Champion logo and everything. There's a couple of designs like this crew. There's also a t-shirt. It's a new design and it's only available for the next eight days. The link is in the description and if you're interested, uh, definitely grab it. I'm super excited to be able to work with, uh, with Champion on this. Uh, the merch quality is really high and yeah, I don't know. I'm just, uh, I'm just super grateful. And it is Thanksgiving after all. Oh, and because this channel is where all the cool kids hang out, you can use promo code Zeffo for 20% off. I know our glorious leader. So now that you've heard uh, my disclaimer and advertisement, uh, you can enjoy this video. I promise it's not deja vu, uh, it's DiGiorno. So this first video uh, we're talking about is called Reuse It. Funny ideas to recycle old toys by 123 Gold. 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 <laughs> oh, there's Amy chomping away on M&Ms again. Man, I could really use some of those right now. Maybe if I ring this doorbell a couple of times. Uh, okay. Okay. Yeah, so sure. <laughs> let's just stop. What are you posing for? I mean, so that far. makes complete sense. So these videos take place inside the mind of of one of their of their characters, I think. One of their strange unnamed characters that, for every video I've seen, most of them are the same, but usually one of them has presumably been killed and replaced with a new clone. Because it's she's new to me. <laughs> oh yeah, we we've never seen her before. Before we watch all of these videos, almost every single one of them includes espionage. Like, can you imagine being that roommate? The person that's just neutral and living their life the way they should be. Right. And always Eating seeing, your M&Ms. <laughs> like, a set of eyes like spaghetti just comes out in the distance, yeah. always around a it's corner. It's like, I can't look my roommate in the eyes, so I have to steal from her like a spy. That's like the- Hi, Caitlin. What do you, what do you need? And she does not acknowledge it. <laughs> She's like, the. Do you want, you want some m and Wait, why are you going to the front door? Let's find out. Maybe if I ring this doorbell a couple of times, Amy will leave the candy alone so I can steal some. That's weird. I'm not expecting company. <sighs> I'd better get the door. And it worked. The candy is mine. Time to dig in. Hello? They could shoot the outside of a real building, right? <laughs> right. These bricks look like they're made of play -Doh. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like it was drawn by a five-year-old. Also, there's an indoor plant outside. <laughs> That's the same plant that was in a different space in the same house. Uh, yeah, it's like if you zoom out, this is just like a painting. <laughs> yeah, and the dictator of this strange nation is stood there. Ha ha ha. Very good, Caitlin. <laughs> That's odd. Better eat as many as I can before she realizes there's no one at the door and comes back. Oh no, Amy's coming back. Oh, screw it. Just grab as many as you can and get out of there, Helly. Okay. Well, here's the thing. Is she hoping that by running away with a bunch of M&Ms, and her not discovering her eating the M&Ms. Yeah. That she'll have no idea what happened. <laughs> right. <laughs> right, because like normally if you live with someone and you see that some of your food is noticeably gone, you mm -hmm. go, oh, my roommate probably, I don't know, had some of this family size bag of M&Ms that I bought for the house. Mm -hmm. And I also just heard sprinting down the hallway and the shaking of M&M's. Yeah, and you hear M&M's <laughs> dropping and bouncing on the ground. Like, she, <laughs> what is she doing? Where were we? Hey, where is all my candy? Oh, come on. It's all gone? Not one piece left? Didn't she... Wait, sorry, roll it back real quick. 
Man, I could really use some of those right now. Some of those. Why did she just take the bag if she was going to steal all of them? Objection. It's a little Phoenix right moment. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> I looked over. It's Phoenix himself. Oh, come on. It's all gone? Not one piece left? Wait a minute. I have an idea. You look innocent enough, Mr. Teddy. I'm going to turn you into the perfect hiding spot. Okay, if you're squeamish, you may not like Whoa, 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 whoa! <laughs> what? What in the world? <laughs> this how, how deep are we? One minute in. One minute. My roommate is a bitch, and there's no way she would <laughs> give me her own M&Ms without me stealing them. And that's why I'll reuse it. <laughs> I won't recycle without threat. So reuse it by killing a bear, yeah. Oh, this new lipstick shade really makes my look pop, doesn't it? Oh, jeez. Stuff is all over the place. I wonder if this jar can come in handy. Is well, every single one of these hacks a jar? <laughs> <laughs> Reuse it, the jar. Ways to put a jar inside an old <laughs> shitty bone. Screw off the jar's lid and set the glass part aside. Take a little toy like. Okay. These are instructions for how to use a jar. <laughs> Take off the. <laughs> But the, it's the the glass is the jar. <laughs> you screw up the lid and put the glass part or whatever that. <laughs> you won't be needing that piece of shit. <laughs> you won't be needing that useless vessel. Oh. Take off the metal top and then toss that piece of glass in the trash. Whatever that is. <laughs> <laughs> whatever it is. Boy, like this one, and flip it onto its back. Take either hot glue or regular white glue. It's so, it's so tool intensive. <laughs> like surely the benefit of a life hack, right, is that it's things lying around the house, you put them together, oh, it's my bears now, it's M&M's. But it's always my bear, some hot glue, a soldering iron, 40 minutes. <laughs> also these things, like one who has this dinosaur. Yeah, so toy. far it's all living things. The other thing is that that bear was perfectly fine as a teddy bear. Yeah, it, it seemed brand new. You didn't reuse it. Yeah. You and, exchanged it. Yeah, yeah, you, you used it <laughs> in a dumb way. <laughs> just like that jar wasn't being reused, it was <laughs> just being tossed out. <laughs> anyway, cut off all the dinosaur's legs and then get rid of the big plastic piece. Buy an iPhone 11 and then toss out the <laughs> futuristic technology that lives inside and use the box as a box. This actually brings up <laughs> Extra box. This brings up something that I wanted to kind of talk about with the public platform mm. is that when you think about it, you're, is it recording? This is recording? Yes. Great. This is, I've been thinking about this. When you have your iPhone, yeah, isn't that kind of a, a black mirror? More like a anti-social media? Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> hey ladies, what you up to? Wait a second, isn't it cleaning day? Who is the narrator? Now, Cause now, before it was like a person that was like we were seeing, yeah, it now like, it's the voice of God. It was an internal monologue, and now it's just the Roomba baby? <laughs> it's that, it's this cat. <laughs> <laughs> Full of M&Ms. <laughs> <laughs> this cat, this is the God cat. Wait, let's, let's, let's watch this back with, uh, with just the cat. Hey ladies, what you up to? Hey ladies, what you up to? Just hanging out? I'm just a cat in a pillow. <laughs> Can I have one of those Coca-Cola vanillas? <laughs> Hold on, sorry. I was distracted by the fact that they are, what the fuck are they doing? <laughs> they have a Roomba and two vanilla Cokes and they're, yeah. what, what is happening? This what is this? This is a lot of data. <laughs> I, I, this is truly my brain cannot process. What are we looking at? Maybe in this dystopian future where cat pillow is the God King. They can't go outside, but they have all this technology, mm -hmm. and, and so they have to create weird, weird games for themselves. Well, all that survived the culling was a Roomba, the God King cat, uh, Coca Cola because it was perfectly sealed, yeah, and yeah. sunflower seeds in a single jar, whatever that's for, <laughs> shared amongst the populace of six people. Time to buckle down and study for that test next week. Twenty minutes. Oh, I totally forgot I made plans with Sophia. Number one, shower. So Sarah Silverman needs to get a shower. <laughs> Why isn't any water coming out? Hey, didn't Mrs. Appleby talk about vinegar working as a cleaning agent in chemistry class last week? Are there little kids in the- Yep. No, there's only two people. As we established <laughs> last time, uh, the class only ever has one to two people in it. They can afford these absolutely ridiculous sets, but can hire a single extra. It makes me wonder who Mrs. Applegate is. This is maybe the only new character that's ended the frame aside from the cat pillow. She poured the vinegar into that beaker of, well, something, and it bubbled and stuff. Think that'll work today? 
Remember that experiment where some bubbling happened? And the teacher then didn't explain what it was. <laughs> Mrs. Applegate, I'm so excited to be back at school. Uh, I am 28 years old, but I'm thrilled to learn. And I am an adult. I'm not a child pretending to be one. Please. And I know lots of stuff. And prove it by doing a science. Okay, well, if you'll look here, I'm pouring a liquid. What is that? Is that a jar? I'll never tell. Into a, uh, into a, into a Erlenmeyer flask. <laughs> and ta-da, it's red. Ah, that's the void liquid that came out on the, the at the end times. That's LCL. <laughs> to get rid of crusty calcium buildup on your shower head or faucet, just pour a plastic bag full with vinegar and secure it in place with some rubber bands. You have to meet Sophia in 20 minutes. What are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> See, it's working already. After just five minutes, this Sophia is, is waiting. What are you doing? <laughs> Text her back. Yeah, <laughs> you're gonna be late. <laughs> Let her know. Let, hey, uh, sorry, Sophia. I decided to clean my shower because that is more important than uh, our plants together. Absolutely, yeah. So uh, catch you on the flip side, loser. <laughs> <laughs> Do the bad boy shower. Two Kleenex. And she's like, oh them. my god, oh my god. Sophia has to meet me in 20 minutes. I've gotta <laughs> take off this robe and. Well, you know, in chemistry class, I did learn about vinegar. Maybe I should clean my shower. Don't be too long, though. You've got plans, remember? <laughs> She's what has she done so far? Instead of. <laughs> Tech Sophia back. She's thought about her science class. Mm, very leisurely took off a robe. She went and grabbed, she got out of the shower, went and grabbed vinegar, and put it something? in a bag. Did we find out what that powder was? No. She said or something and she just grabbed vinegar. So she made a special liquid, put it over her shower, didn't clean the shower head after. I know that's a very small detail, but that means she's getting hit with at least half a second of pure vinegar straight to the bottom. It's bar. true, it's true. Gross. Um, now that's the face of someone who just went on a shopping spree. What does that say? If you stay happy, you think happy. Say yes. Well, yeah, I guess, right? <laughs> yeah. But that's not like a proactive thing you can do. If you think happy, you stay happy is a like a dumb platitude. At hey, least it makes um, sense. Hey, Doc, I... Look, I, I, I've been struggling a lot with like my feelings of self-worth and... I feel great! I... Do you have any advice for me, though? Yeah! Look at me. Look how happy I am. Okay. Now, if you stay healthy... Healthy, okay. You'll think healthy. I have an illness. So, what'd you get? Aren't these tennies just darling? They're perfect for school. I truly don't know how this is going to turn into a genius lazy cleaning hack, but I, I you know what I know for sure? Is this is definitely uh, gonna be an easy cleaning tip to clean you room fast. <laughs> If you stay happy, you think happy. <laughs> yes, it's the best part of the day, lunchtime. Is this Sophia or is this a, a I, body At this point, it's impossible to know. It might be a third. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. That's snow cream guy. And boy, does this smell good. Whoa. So what are we working with here? We've got um, some tabbouleh or hummus straight in the center. <laughs> uh, you've got french fries. Some very cold, wet pita bread right at the bottom right. Uh, pita, that for the us US English speakers. Relax, bro. Uh, you've got red onions. Raw red onions. A very thick tomatoes. You say tomato, I say tomato. But uh, neither of us know how to say whatever the hell that protein is. Mm. It, oh, no, I know what that is. It's clench. Oh, it's for, I forgot. The native protein it's of- It's actually uh, of, of Bechdesnan or whatever it was called. <laughs> Supplies start to run a little low and Vicky's been ticking you off a little bit and she falls obviously to the, the dark plague that's and, spread across the land. And you, you gotta cook her reuse, up. <laughs> reuse it. Reuse your friend <laughs> who reuse died. Your she had one life uh, as your friend and another on a plate. <laughs> Cannibalism. Wow, Sophia, you got mm. quite the appetite, don't you? Okay, all done. I'm so full. Well, I'd better clean this mess up and get back to work. Yikes! As if Sophia didn't see this when she was grabbing her dishes to be Yeah, there. as somebody that- Whoa, who put this here? <laughs> when I used to live with people before uh, the dark times, I would, I do this now and then, you know, I, mm. I wouldn't necessarily clean up my dishes straight away. And I, it was not through not knowing that there were a lot of dishes to right, do. Right, right. <laughs> if, if this was the version of me, that face goes from kind of disgusted to like sneaky. I look left and right a few times and then this is the motion. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like spring yeah, back yeah. to my bedroom. It's not, oh, oh. I ate 15 meals and I forgot. Who, who is this 
disgusting monster. Oh, dang it. Only there was a way to get around having to wash. There's like seven plates there. Yeah, it's really not a big and deal. And she's like, the hours of work and all, all those plates are are dirty with soy sauce, which is really the only thing <laughs> yeah. she eats. Well, that's what Vicky's blood looked like. You oh, see. right. Yeah. Pour some glue onto the fingers like this and stick cut strips of a coarse sponge onto them. You can do this to all five fingers. Do you want to make your sponge less effective? Mm -hmm. uh, allow these us countless hours you've wasted using a sponge the way that's most effective. <laughs> Would you like to make that worse and more time consuming? <laughs> Let's show you how. It's best to squeeze out the glue in the shape of a Z. You know what that Z stands for? I'd rather not say. Zeppo. Did you hear that? It's okay, he's probably not here. Yeah, I, 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 luckily I don't think um, Lord Zeppo has reign over this, over this world. No, we're free now. We're, right? On top. You said we were free. The Z is pretty compelling. Once it's all dry, you're ready to go. They just deconstructed I mean, a sponge and then insane. put it on her hand. You know you use your hand to hold the sponge. Mm -hmm. This takes hours to do. Absolutely, This yeah. takes longer than doing your dishes. But it's genius. It's lazy, it's cleaning and hacks, and it will tidy your room. <laughs> and how many, it will tidy, it will clean your room. <laughs> it will clean your room, fast. Uh, you stay happy, wait, what is it? Stay happy, think happy. Clean your room. <laughs> <laughs> Clean your That's what the shirt says. Simply squeeze out some soap onto the damp sponge and get scrubbing. Without having to hold the sponge, washing plates is way easier on your wrists and arms. Why? In in what way? <laughs> the the premise of this <laughs> the premise of this should have been you know when you get arthritis from, from <laughs> yeah. all of that from all of those dishes that you have to clean after the great leader brings you back from the beyond and rigor mortis has set in and you can't move your fingers independently then use these cleaning gloves. <laughs> One of the best things about a lazy afternoon is well being lazy and being super silly of course. Whoa, careful with your snacking there, Sophia. What, did you run out of plates or something? What are you doing? <laughs> well, this is actually just a message directly to Sophia, who, by the way, in this video, has gone from a lovable fool to, like, a nemesis. I, I hate Sophia yeah, now. She's a giant slob <laughs> and big fan of Fendi. And enter. Whoa, huh? What's all this? Shoot, I got crumbs all over my keyboard. Bella, a little help? This is like, um when you like get home and you realize your dog has like ransacked <laughs> yeah. the apartment, but instead it's your adult roommates. <laughs> they turn around. Well, uh, sorry. Uh, they duck their head. <laughs> she's like holding, she's got her gloves on. And, <laughs> and like <laughs> crumbs in her mouth. Gloves on, crumbs of crackers, a few keyboard keys and some M&Ms <laughs> and an open jar. A dead body on the floor. <laughs> That's the one that doesn't bother them. To clean up hard to reach crumbs, Try putting something sticky over them like this goo. Because slime all in the air vent. And that's <laughs> now so that's dangerous. We need a life hack for cleaning the slime out of the air vent. Well, you gotta get a Ritz cracker and really. <laughs> Excuse me, Mr. Apple Genius. I uh, my laptop doesn't work and I don't know why. Yeah. Oh wow! Think happy or stay happy. <laughs> Apple Care. <laughs> Hey Emily, what you watching? Hey, who said you could take a bite of- These colors are clearly to continue engaging the children yeah. that are the uh, audience of this channel that they are just afraid to admit. Seriously? Next time your buddy decides to steal your grub, well, try well, eating well, them well, a mouthful well, of something well, they won't well, well, oh, oh, okay. well, you ruined your banana. Okay. Mm. You know when your friend eats your banana specifically, which is not a thing that I've ever experienced. I mean, it's on her. Look at this posture. Yeah, she's holding it in front of her friend's mouth. Is that a dirty sock? This is... This is like weirdly sensual. Yeah, she doesn't look that happy. She also has no peripheral vision. Yeah, at all. And in fact, <laughs> even if she kept her eyes firmly on the laptop. Yeah. I trust my friend. I just stole from them two times. I'm sure I can get away with it. For I'm pretty sure time. she like even looks at the banana. Like she looks, she looks straight down at the banana. Is that a dirty sock? Oh, oh. Banana? <laughs> yeah. God, oh. I hate the taste. Walks off holding the sock. <laughs> Where's your sock? Give me that sweet, sweet sock. 
That ought to teach Emily to find her own snacks from now on. That ought to teach Emily to not trust me, her friend. You should probably hit pause and go brush her teeth. <laughs> <laughs> Doing a little light cleaning on a Sunday is always a good idea. Okay, looks like I'm just about done. Uh, Amy, you gonna help out your friend there? Oh, what's going on with these sponsors? This isn't. Surely there's no way they're sponsored. No way. But also, the weird thing about these things is that their apartments are always spick and span. Oh, yeah. Except for, like, the one, like, vessel of trash. It's because they, the hacks, Jarvis. Okay. If you had hacks to clean your room, <laughs> every inch of the house would be spotless, especially But this is Funniest DIY Tricks on Friends and Family, family by 123 one, on Entree. Hmm. Looks like whatever's going on on her phone is way more interesting than cleaning. Why waste all that energy when you know your neat freak friend is just gonna do it all anyway? Your neat freak friend wouldn't be a shoes on household. <laughs> yeah, that's Unless true. you never walk outside. There is no outside. There is only Zepho. This window is clearly to nowhere. Yeah, this is clearly like a light panel. I think it's painted on. Yeah. Don't go towards the light. <laughs> so this, this bitch never used a phone, right? <laughs> like she's, she's thrilled by it. Oh, she's just typing numbers. <laughs> you only put a calculator in this? Phew, I'm exhausted from all this cleaning. This is truly a like discourse on toxic relationships oh, yeah. in which the parties never address their toxicity. Probably because I'm the only one doing it. Hey, Amy? What? Would you mind doing me a favor and push down that trash over there? Pretty please? Good move, Amy. It's the least you can do for your friend. <laughs> <laughs> they don't communicate about anything, but the thing she the says one are, thing she I didn't know was gonna be how did do you know who did this? Also, the one time she decides to talk to her friend is like, hey, <laughs> hey, you know how I did all that cleaning? Yeah. Perhaps you could help me out in this one way. Before pranking her, should, could it just said, hey, um, I've been doing a lot of cleaning. Perhaps you could like help me take out the trash. Which worked. <laughs> like, it yeah, she wasn't did going work. to say no. So you pranked her because she didn't like wordlessly help you. You could have just spoken to your friend. But I wouldn't have allowed her to do funniest DIY tricks on friends and family by what do you three guys? Uh, also, uh, this is not a trash can, it is a bucket. That's a bucket, yeah. It is a bucket for like sand at the beach. <sighs> trash cans were destroyed in the fires. Yeah. <laughs> Along with every normal type of watering can. <laughs> this is deranged. Every <laughs> normal type of anything, to be honest. Everything is strangely generic, but has brand names on it. Let's see how much water she puts in, by the way. Insane. That is insane. A, a small <laughs> amount of water. Because the other, the amount of water that is in that bucket when she steps her foot down is a full bucket it's, of water. It's more than would allow trash to be in the bucket. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Also, weird place to have a trash can. It's like dead in the center of your living room. Um, I, you don't know shit about interior <laughs> design. Ugh, now my sock is soaking wet. I hate you, Lily. Whoa, Jesus. That was nearly, she, she could have slipped and really hurt yeah, herself. Yeah, that was rough. And also, that was... No, a tad severe. It's a prank. Like, I hate you. I know it was a it was a bit intense, but you know what it was? It was also a cool, cool vibe. vibe. <laughs> I know that made a big mess, but it was totally worth it. Maybe next Sunday you'll set aside some time to help dust. Yeah, Amy. I think I'm not gonna hang out with you anymore. Yeah, move maybe. Uh, I might. Yeah, I yeah. think this is the end of our relationship. Actually, I will clean up my room into storage boxes and leave. When nature calls, it's always a good time to ponder life's most important questions. Lana, come here. Well, I mean that's the prank. <laughs> Can we do? Come watch me. <laughs> <laughs> what do you want? Darkwing duck. That's yeah, a random. Okay. <laughs> that's a random shirt to be wearing. I mean, you know, there's very limited <laughs> sets of apparel. What do you want? Can you snag me my phone, pretty please? Okay, hold on. Ugh, finally. Whoa, I have like 20 unanswered texts. Ugh, what's happening? Everything's going dark. If there's one thing we know about this character is that she doesn't know how to use her yeah, phone. Yeah, for sure. Everything's going dark because she hasn't been able to turn it on. <laughs> no, everything's going dark is actually the beginning of the event. It's yeah, one of the first that's signs. That's the thing that comes over the siren. Yeah. Everything's going dark. It's, a, it's actually the intro to her origin story, her like dark night. Uh, everything went dark. <laughs> Wing duck. Okay. Then me for that, right? Okay. Wow, even less than before. 
Minus. I didn't know it did negative. Yikes. Would you be a doll and snag my charger? I'm on 2%, see? No, that's dead. <laughs> that's a dead phone. Oh, wait, hang on. That's it, it just her background. That's an image. She said... <laughs> oh, maybe that's the prank. Okay. She's pranked her by taking a screenshot of a... It's not even what the charging like thing looks like. Because the, when it's up close, it's, it is the way it normally is. But I think that's because she tapped it and so it went full screen. So this is like, this is a deep prank. It's, that's the, the flashlight, right? So that's the lock screen. Oh, that is the lock screen. But there's screen. no clock on there. That's- She's a wizard, man. Yeah. She changed her phone lock screen to the dead lock. I'm confused. I mean, we're assuming this is an iPhone. It's most likely a, a Bedson Stein or Kitschnikels. It's a Zephone. Don't say his fucking name in vain, bro. Incoming. Uh, thanks. All right, let's juice this puppy up. Do you have an outlet next to your toilet? I don't think she does. Uh, <laughs> she, she seems to put it in her lap. Uh, Snag me. <laughs> looks like you're fresh out of toilet paper there. Oh man, you've gotta be kidding me. Well, go ahead and call her. Lana, can you come here a sec? What now? Oh, you need toilet paper? I got you, girl. Oh, can we talk about how uh, Lana is opening the door to the void? Mm -hmm. Every background in all of these videos is just a solid color. Yeah, I mean, it melts away as soon as the video stops yeah. to reveal the great leader directing it from a director's chair shouting, it's going dark. <laughs> Think happy, stay Be happy. <laughs> For this, you'll need a lint roller and a roll of toilet paper to put together like this. Lastly, you'll need a blow dryer. Plugged in, of course. Perfect. Was this? Was this whole frame sponsored by cartoons in the 90s? <laughs> it really the was. In reverse. <laughs> well, that'll teach you not to force your friend to wait on you while you're stuck in the bathroom. How many how many things in this house are neon blue? Yeah, they're, this is a house made only of primary colors. <laughs> <laughs> I hope you have another roll waiting. Amy, are you in there? Ugh, just barely. I'm gonna get you back, Lana. Hard that? cut to just blood. <laughs> I'm gonna get you back. It's a slow zoom out on Lana's dead body. I'm gonna get you back, Lana. And she's just like blowing a blow dryer on it. It's like how funny. <laughs> she's like wobbling as the knives. Yeah, she's just blowing everybody. the toilet paper. She's like, you're gonna need to clean that up, huh, Lana? <laughs> how do you feel about one, two, three, go? Now that you, how, how do you feel they progressed in the past six months? Well, I used to be very afraid of them, mm -hmm. uh, and now I'm very afraid of them. But, on the other side, at least the videos are long. <laughs> that is true. <laughs> they do have that going for them. Yeah, they're bad, but at least they never seem to end. On the bright side, um, which is another channel by the same people. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, yeah. Uh, they, these videos are videos, so that's cool. That's true, and they are online. But remember, kids, think happy, stay, stay happy. happy. What? Did you? Oh my god. Knock at the door. Uh, yeah. The dark times have begun, for I am Lord Zephyr. Hard cut to black. It's it's my dead body. <laughs> nice full blow dryer on your face. 